Okay, guys, welcome. Finish my job for Spike. <sighs> Hope I did enough. If we don't get some more antis in, then the whole tower's done. I had to spend the night in a safe house. The sun was setting, and I would have gotten caught in the dark. Okay, guys, welcome to Dying Life Part Five. He just explained exactly what happened. We got caught in the night time after setting all the traps, and we had to stay at the the safe house because if we didn't, we would have got killed. We saw our first what I think is a jumper. I'm not quite. I think he's yeah. I think he's a jumper. He he jumped away, so I'm assuming he's one of the jumpers. Okay, so let's see. Spike, what's going on? Something bad happened. We need to talk. Okay, give me a sec. Oh wait, I completed the prologue. I can actually open this now. And I could actually get myself an outfit. Okay, so I need cash for it. I really want that ninja outfit. I'm buying it. I have to buy it. I have these dirt. I'm an idiot. Okay, see so where we gotta go. We gotta go over there. Okay, I can get back used to this running. This whole running scheme. Okay, he's over there. Of course, you're never supposed to be left out in the streets. But I'm a moron, and I love to run on the streets. So, we're gonna run on the streets. Let me catch my breath before I run past him. Bye, sir. He's just standing there on fire. Like, hey guys, how you doing? I'm not on fire or anything like that. Okay, now go visit Spike. Spike, what's up? Crane, first of all, you did great out there. From now on, if you need something, come see me. And to start with, Use a UV flashlight and a remote control. Oh. You run up on a volatile, give him a face full of UV, or lead him into a trap which you can trigger with that remote. You got it? Got it. Perfect. Now for the bad news. Despite your efforts, Brecken's mission failed. Ooh, shit, is he okay? He's alive. But you need to get back to the tower. Jay called all the scouts in, and that means you. Okay. Wonder if I'll finally get to meet Brecken in person. Yeah, if you get to meet him, he's dead. Oh, he's dying. He's not dead, but um. So okay, so uh, the UV light. I actually played some of the Be the Zombie, and I can act wrong way. And I can actually explain what that is. Um, what the UV light does is if, uh, let's say a runner, they're the volatiles, volatiles. So if the runner decides to run after you, you can actually stun him with the UV light and he actually has to run away. Like he can't do anything. It drains all of his energy. Which is pretty helpful if I get cut out in the dark. Now where are the... Of course, I'm making a call. Crane here. Report. I'm about to have a meeting with the tower's leader. Acknowledged. Confirm his identity and contact us immediately. Yes. I will. Don't worry. They're gonna eventually find out. He calls her so met so much. Like every literally every single second, he's calling her. It's how these games always like end. They always find out about it. Okay, not this way. I need a. Uh... I can't go that way. 
Oh wait, it's up here. <laughs> Hello sir, how are you doing? Okay, we have to go through the elevator and up. Brecken's mission failed. Jade called a meeting in the tower. It's my opportunity to finally meet with Brecken and confirm his identity. Okay, time to meet Brecken. Great. Let's see, we have to go this way. So we're gonna go to headquarters. <clears throat> Crane. Listen, Brecken and a team of runners went after an airdrop last night. He lost the rest of his team to biters, and then Rise's men ambushed him, beat him to a pulp, and stole the drop. Now Brecken wants to go after the next drop himself, but Oof. we can't let him, and you've got to back me up. First marry me, and I'll, I'll uh, consider that. You can't even walk straight. We need you alive, you idiot. Okay, we're going in. Act confident. Yes, I will. Marry me first. Brecken? Lena? Maybe you can get through to him. Jade, who's your friend? Kyle Crane. Look, Brecken, the last thing we need is for you to go back out there. We can figure out another way without jeopardizing you. Right, Crane? I'll go. I'll do it. Right. Yes. Crane will go. He'll be happy to. Marry me. Yeah, marry me now. Funny simple. Jesus. No offense, friend, but you're as green as grass. You can't just... Crane will manage. He'll start in the right spot. And Lena's right. You need to be here taking care of the towers, convincing them the world's not over yet. Oh, hell. Maybe one more try before we go to Rice. Yeah. Okay, fine. <gasps> oh, I thought I was... I just thought his arm was just formed and that's his thumb. Oh my god. I literally thought there was like something sticking out of his arm. I got bone. For the cauldron, I'll be in touch shortly. Damn, you got a nice butt on you, girl. I mean, thank you for uh, giving me this mission. Look, there's something else we need to discuss. Brecken was hurt pretty bad out there. Worse than he wants people to know. He was raped. He took a Fuck. blow to the head. Now he's starting to have seizures, and I don't have any Laura tracks. Yeah, I doubt anyone does. Well, stop smoking a cigarette, drugs girl. Being passed out like candy when the infection first started. And the stores ran out weeks ago. Yes, that's right. How do you know that? Look, what do you need me to do, Lena? There's a man in town named Gazi. He's not altogether there, if you know what I mean. <laughs> He's <laughs> crazy. Had epilepsy, so he used to pick up medicine for her each month. She died two years ago. But Gazi kept going to the store to pick up her prescription. He likes his routine, and Gazi can be very inconsistent. Consistent. Okay. So they kept giving it to him. You think he's been stockpiling it all this time? If he hasn't, I don't know where else we're going to get it from. Gazi lives under the overpass. And don't mention his mother's death. He won't understand. Great. Now I'm gonna talk to Aloni. Mother's Day. Down the elevator we go, right down. With most of the runners out of action, Brecken wants the scouts to take their place. That means me. We're supposed to go for the next airdrop right before sunset. Jade will be showing me the ropes. Now that won't be awkward at all. Eh. Just show her some loving boy. He'd be good. It's been three months now. When will they let us out? Come here. I've got a special deal for you. You? What do you want? I have none of this crap. I'll sell you something. What would you want? You want nothing? Get away from me then. Ok. 
Okay, you can go over there. I'm gonna make this call, guys, and we're gonna end this end this uh, video. Ooh, yes, made it. Crane here. Report. Tower boss is named Brecken, and he's definitely not your man. The other likely suspect is this warlord, basically. Local guy. Calls himself Rise. He's hoarding Antizen and then gouging the hell out of anybody who wants to buy some. I'm on a mission to get Antizen from the airdrop. If I don't succeed, they'll have to come up with something else. Acknowledged. Good job, Crane. You're doing well. Mm -hmm. Stay on task, and we'll be in touch. Be sure to call us immediately if and when you get that Antizen. Yeah. I'll think about it. Let's see what's in here. String. Whoa! in here we have aerosol and coffee coffee great got something looked like chewing tobacco to me okay the fudge are you up there God forbid, who knows where you are. Okay, so guys, we're going to end it here, and I will see you in part six when we get back. Bye.